Here in Tennessee, people with a disability are twice as likely to be unemployed. Numbers from the state show about 21% of people with a disability have a job. 65% of people without a disability are in the workforce. Tennis reporter Maria Guzman joins us from our newsroom tonight to explain how one mother in our community is working to close that gap. Maria. John Jennifer Carpenter has made it her life's mission to help other parents like her because she knows how it feels to be a young mother trying to find the right resources to raise her daughter with disabilities. Her daughter is now 20 years old and she tells me it took a community to help her. It's a diagnosis that no parent expects to hear. I wasn't given a checklist of you need to do this, this, and this for your child. I was just given a diagnosis that um, was earth shattering to a new mom. Jennifer Carpenter knows that feeling too well. She tells me one of her twin daughters lives with a disability. You have this diagnosis, Shaylin has cerebral palsy. But that disability turned into her life mission to help other parents like her. Through a community-wide disability fair like this one, she helps families find resources to help their kids. So now that I work in the school system and I see where our parents are, our parents don't know what they don't know. She says outreach like this is important and shows employers the value of expanding their candidate pools. And our adults, you know, they want to work. They want to be a part of a community. They want to be involved and valued within their community. Now, this is the fourth fair she's hosted, and her goal is to continue them throughout Blount County. John. Maria Guzman on that story. Thank you, Maria.